Hey, what's going on everybody? Heem the Dream, back at it again with the UFC 3. Here I have a fighter showcase for you guys. I'm using Dominic, Dominator Cruz, the former UFC Bantamweight Champion. And here, the reason why I'm finally using Cruz is because they finally fixed the man up. Like, you know, you see what I did right there, that uh, Cruz jab, uh, Cruz straight, excuse me? Now they fixed it where like you don't do it when you're moving like when you're moving forward like when you're holding forward and doing a moving strike You don't automatically do it. They gave him the regular jab straight now like the way you do The cruise jab straight is you have to do it while flicking the stick like you have to flick the stick towards your opponent And then press whether you want to do the jab or the straight now like it's it is his version of the contextual jab straight so Anywho, I'm here using Dominic Cruz, and you see that uh, I have my name hidden. It's because I'm on my Rogue account. Um, I started a new rank on my Rogue account, which none of y'all will know. None of y'all know. Not even my bros know. My real bros like Romero, Marshall, or uh, Unibot, they don't know who and what this account is. So if you run into it, and I beat you, and I know who you are. Not gonna say anything. Not gonna give it up. But anywho, let's get into the fight, man. I'm going against a John Dodson here, and early on we did rock him, and we're putting on the pressure, attacking his body here. Ooh, caught it with a nice three piece right there. I wasn't trying to throw a head kick there. I think I was trying to throw an uppercut, but it still landed. I don't know why I ain't rocking, but anywho, right now you know with Cruz you have to keep moving you have to use your distance man you have to make your opponents miss man because Cruz he he is one of the more elusive I think the most elusive uh banner weight in the division you know you can put TJ in that class but TJ I don't know TJ is, is a more aggressive fighter than Cruz I mean he does use his movement he does like you know try to keep to the outside here and there but TJ is way more aggressive. I think he's way more, yeah, he's way more aggressive than Cruz. Cruz like to make you miss, make you pay. Counter counter strike. Just pick at you. I I used to call him the Floyd Mayweather of the of the UFC man because how his uh how he makes opponents miss, you know, makes them look silly at times. But um uh, we got on rock right here. I'm going to get Majin Dorgon again. He's he's Dotson and uh, uh, I played him before on my far accounts. I, I forgot how he plays, but the way he was playing, he was getting a little aggressive. And right there, I shot for an um, ankle pick, but uh, I didn't get it. And I was able to drop him right there before the round ended. And yeah, I think we took that round. But again, when you're using crews, guys, you got to keep your distance. You got to use your movement. No, he has his signature movement, his signature like evasive uh evasion um animations. So but my my uh strategy using Cruz in the first round I'll stand and strike with you. I'll stand and strike with you and uh I'll switch between Southpaw and Orthodox accordingly. And right here in the second round I'll try to grapple. Test out your grappling with Cruz because Cruz is a good grappler. Um, he has 90 clinch, 90 clinch throw. He has a 92 top game. You know, he's a pretty good grappler, you know. So, first round, I'll stand and strike with you. I'll try to pick at you, see what you want to do. And the second round, I'll try to grapple you and test out your grappling, make you work here and there, make you work a little bit. But if I can keep you on the ground in the second round, if I can keep you on the ground in general, then yeah, I'll. Uh, I'll try to grapple, uh, grapple F you, try to limit on the cussing. <laughs> Again, this guy here, let's say he's moving forward, he's trying to pressure me a little bit, but we picking at him, man, but we see I did the, uh, <laughs> the cruise evasive right there, then I did it again, a little sidestep, I switched southpaw, I tried to do it again, but he caught me with a hook, nice on him, he was picking up on it, he was like, I'm tired of your stuff, he's not going to keep doing that, so I'm going to throw hooks and try to counter that. Uh, he used his head movement. It was empty head movement, so he paid the price right there. Hit him to the body, came back up top, knocked him down, caught him with an upcut. 
rocked him. Guys, nice. he's backpedaling. Oh, catching him with overhand. Catch him with another overhand. <laughs> Try to throw a head kick. I try to throw my own overhand. Right now, putting the pressure on him. Boom, caught him with the uppercut while he returned his head on the uh, center line. Right there, I was just winging shots. But now he's trying to move his head. Empty slip and trying to evade. And I'm trying to catch him with something right here. Standing southpaw. I love fighting southpaw with Cruz. I don't know. I think he's more better suited southpaw. Oh, damn. As soon as I'm talking about southpaw, we end up knocking the guy cold, out cold. Damn. Uppercut hook ends the fight. First fight was a success. Let's move on to the second fight, man. Boom, Cardi with the upper. And now here we're going against TJ Dillashaw. Great matchup, great matchup, and Bastards got me in the blue corner. I hate the blue corner. I really do. I hate it. I hate it with a passion. But again, like I was saying earlier, TJ TJ Dillashaw is probably the only man in the division that can match Cruz's movement and keep up with him. But uh, he is way more aggressive. He doesn't really like, I mean, he does keep his distance. He does try to evade and make you pay, but his style is a little bit more aggressive than Cruz. And here we're going against D. Barish 1. Right here. Cody with that leg kick. Uh, Fainting. Check that leg kick. I like using that feint. You know, it looked like I'm going to throw the. Uh, the contextual, cruise contextual jab or straight, but I'm fainting it, and damn, right here he was. Got me down, got me down, got me down. He was like, I'm tired of you running away from me. I'm tired of you using movement. I'm tired of you trying to, like, point fight me, and I'm going to take you down. I'm like, all right. And here we go, lag spiking. It's going to be a theme of this fight right here. Lag spiking at the most worst times. And okay, right here he has me mounted, back mounted, and we st we stay right here for a little bit, man. Try to do the get up, but my flick of the stick, look at the flick of the stick, not working. <laughs> so like I said, we sit right here for a little bit, man, because uh, again I tried to, I was trying to um time the get up so I could flip him off, but wasn't working so he has me in a rear neck and choke spoiler I get out of it <laughs> so back and back now I'm just gonna sit here and wait sit here and wait sit here and wait he has my back again I deny that that's all I was waiting on just if you wanna try to flatten me out and just try to deny you drain that stamina of yours but flatten me out again Posture up again the back mount. Again, I'm trying to flick at the stick. Not working. Flattens me out again. I get right back up again. And that's like, you know what? Forget it. Let me just flip over the half guard. Just work. Gets in the side saddle. I'm able to get the back side. Able to not the <laughs> babble mouth stutter. Able to deny that. And now he's trying to break my block and sprawl. Able to get up. Spins around. He tries it for the takedown. I deny that. And we're able to break. And I'm out. So. Here we go. Faint. Try to hit a late kick. Nowhere near. Boom. Throws the head kick. Nice. Ooh. Try to hit me with the death wombo combo. The death combo. As Marshall would say, the death combo. Romero calls it the wombo combo. I'll chain the two together and call it the Death Wombo combo. And then there you go. He can't follow. He catches me with the head kick. And then, oh, oh, oh. you thought you was going to get away with it, huh, bro? Uppercut drops him at the end of the round. We get to get back. He catches me with the head kick. I drop him with the uppercut at the end of the round. Pretty good round. I don't know who won that. You probably could give it to me at the last second when I dropped him. Good round this part. He definitely uh he he definitely grappled me, you know, held me down on the ground for a little bit, controlled me. But he was able to get that knockdown now. He's in my face. 
Trying to pressure a little bit. Dominic Cruz has perhaps the most creative footwork we've ever seen inside the But yeah, Octagon. using Dominic Cruz, man, you gotta pick your shots right, you gotta be precise, make everything count. Can't get into a dog fight. Trying to like come out and go out guns blazing. And be aggressive and try to like brawl. Rock'em Soccer Robots with a, a TJ Dillashaw or a Cody Garbrandt because they have way more power to prove you will lose that battle 10 times out of 10. And this guy takes me down again. I thought I denied it, but again, the stickity stick stick. Don't no, respond, he respond, spawn. So he was able to block that. I tried to get a takedown on my own, but a lag spike. And he's able to deny. Deny that guillotine intent. And I get up and uh, get the backside. Reversal backside. Now I got his back. He flips over the, the cover's guard. I try to posture up the stack. He denies. So I posture up the stack again. He denies again. Now he flips me over the top mount. Okay, this guy has a pulse a little bit on the ground. Kind of underestimating him. Since this is my placement matches on my world account. Gotta get out of that habit. Excellent movement and transitions here on At like well, whatever, whoever I'm going against. At like I'm going against like somebody like Marshall, Unibot, Romero, um, Swiss, Goat, Ash, one of the top players like them. Gotta go in there like I'm going against them, man, so I can be at the top of my game. A day shot for ankle pick. And every time that anybody shoots for ankle pick and misses, I always walk up to them for an uppercut. Nine times out of ten, they always try to block the body when they're getting on because they're going to go for the body. Go so for that uppercut, go uppercut hook. Nine times out of ten, it will win. A day shoot for take down again. And the laggy, 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 back, 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 Able to deny that half guard transition. Now we landed a couple of knees. Hit me with the fake of Rooney. Look how this half guard. And we posture up. Now let's see what we can do here. Boom. He covers full. I was able to transition out. Deny that. And the end of the round is coming up. And we're going to rain down some round and pound before the end of the round. And boom. Seven round with success. It says we are ahead of the fight thanks to our striking advantage. So we are up 2 0. So we definitely did win that first round when we knocked him down. Third round underway. Alright, check the leg kick. There's another leg kick. Try to hit the wombo combo on me. We got all that. <coughs> Excuse me. I think. Just Shuffle. Away from landing one of those big Just right trying hands. to give him, give him looks, man. Give him different looks. They can commit to something so I can throw some. He blocks the punch. Blocks that. Starting to do some really significant damage. Third body strike. It's missing. There. Yep. Oh, there's another kick. Try to check it. He's keeping his head protected here. Excellent blocking. Loses lower jaw. Very good. That body kick. Now he's trying to throw, trying to catch me with something, man. He has to. He has to be a little bit more aggressive here. He's he losing. Block that. Tag the body. Try to tag the body again, just out the way. Boom, oh, catching me with the death combo. Alright, but he overcommitted. We caught him with that because oh, hook. Drop him. I'm gonna him right there. Yep, oh, laggy, laggy, lag, 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 spike. Drop him, though. Taunt him. Get him in his head, get him in his head. Boom, throws a oh, head kick, catch him with the straight. Big straight punch. Contextual straight. Nasty combinations. I think I try to throw it again here. Slightly yeah. deflected. I think it's coming again. I think I try oh, to throw it. Really start to apply pressure on his opponent Boom. here. Different Catch him with the straight. The last couple rounds, and it's the exact Boom. sense of urgency you want to see from a fighter. I love that animation. Oh, we're finally able to deny a takedown, guys. Take back, I think. <laughs> 
They had Tone right there. Like, yeah, you, you ain't get me this time, brother. Finally went through. Boom, catch with the head kick. I don't understand how that is. I mean, that lock him and drop him. Again. Now he's on death's door. Knocking on death's door. Up the cut. Body shot. Body shot again. Believe that uh, Endemir is coming. Body shot. Now he's just throwing Hail Mary strikes, but it's all over, man. We got him at our mercy right here. Hit with that Strazate. Why he's throwing that body kick. Try to clinch me. Clinch me ain't gonna really help you right now, but these family's too low. But even when I say that, he rocks me. Block. Transition out. And we are out the clutch. Let's go, man. It's a nice just throw Hail Mary strikes. Hopefully it'll land something on the L, but it's not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. The end there is coming. He is a uh, death's door. About to kick the bucket. About to buy the farm. Boom. Double uppercut. Ends him, and then I'm petty and I jump right on him. Land a few unnecessary ground and pound strikes, and uh, ha ha, yeah. On to the last fight, fellas. And here we are going against another John Dotson. Hmm, interesting. I thought in these fights I would have fought like a lot of TJs, maybe some Cody's here and there. Maybe a Sugar Sean, but nah. I fought two John Dotsons in this video. Man. All right, here's what we got his back. We got him in the back sitting. Raining down the body punches. Able to transition now. Back to back. Back side. And uh, we get up. We don't want to grab right now. Like I said, round one with Cruz, I always want to stand. I want to stand, see see where your head's at, see what you want to do. And then round two and three, I'll implement the grappling. Catches me with the overhand. I don't understand. Why everybody trying to take me down, man? Why is everybody trying to grab me, man? And then this Dotson one to grab me. Dotson one grabbing me, man. Dotson's not too shabby, man. I mean, he is shabby. Excuse me. He can't grapple with Cruz. He doesn't have no grappling whatsoever. And then his grappling stamina is Chautauqua. Mushrooms. So right here, I'm like, alright, you, you want to dance, cowboy? He said, yeah. Well, let me throw that elbow and get that easy rock, that cheap rock. So, I'm like, all right, that's, that's cool, that's cool. I ain't gonna get mad at that. That was cute. Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got so we in South Paul. Throw a little, little shuffle right there. Throw a little cruise movement here, right there. Unnecessary, the but did it anyway. <laughs> right now we meet in the South Paul. Trying to land that left hand. Left straight, left hand. He blocks the punch. For that little kick, man. He's fainting with that punch, showing that right punch. now. He's doing a great job of blocking. Just trying to pinpoint catch right here. Boom, trying to take me like down. No trying to take me down. Deny that. Deny that. He's denied the takedown. He's losing stamina. Clean inside uh, get real leg comfortable kick. fighting out of south ball. But he's dropping right there with a hook. I'm taking the body up. Ha <laughs> ha, hit you with that wombo death combo. He's back up again. Yeah, he's back up. Good kick to the body there by Dodson. Now he's a little angry. He's going to pressure me a little bit. I'm moving, just circling away from his power here. This could be it. Throw a little pirouette. Oh, Stay back this. Stay back this again. Big body shot. shot there, too. And throw a little jab hook uppercut. Whoop, ha! Huh. Good defense there. Missed me. The he's trying to grab me. Now, Slow dance. We not oh, having none of that. He's right. just circling. Keep him away from his power right strike. His power here. That one hurt. Up a play hook. Oh. And he's dropping. Oh. At the end of the round, we got three enough. Saved by the bell. Could hop on him, but we definitely worked with that round. Second round. That last round was absolutely insane. Both guys hurt on both Put a little shuffle. Ducked, just trying to commit to something. I tried to 
I try to duck that jab, evade the jab, and shoot for a double leg. Cannot be defined. He's an ever improving player. He, he kind of turned it on right here. I was doing some good. Never mind. I thought that I caught it with that lock. Oh, I don't understand how that didn't drop him right there. Nice that should have ended his life. Wow. But now he catches me, clinches me. I was slow dancing. He's denied that. Probably a guy right there with the takedown. Respect that down. down. Do anything with it, partner? Can you do anything with it? Nope. Deny that. And we're back on our feet. And I taught him right there, like, haha, you can't keep me down. Haha. Man, and the boo boo catch me. Going to get the shuffle, but he's going to get the pick right there. He's going to get the shuffle. I took him down. So I have to pick you apart right here, son. We'll pick you apart right here, son. Now we pressure. Now we putting the pressure on. Ooh, body kick. Now we eat those for breakfast, bro. We eat them like Fruit Loops. Oh, well, I don't want to eat that, though. I'm allergic to that. I'm allergic to head kick. Oop, not today. Oh, I missed my hook. I would have rocked you. Just over two minutes to go. So now you back to him. Oh. Uh, you know it's like over, right? It's over. The end is near. Boom, oh. catch you with the head kick on. So like, how do you still let him get that? Okay, now, so I'm definitely doing it. I think this fight is about to be over. Yeah, fight's about to be over. Uh, he taunts me like, yeah, yeah, come on, knock me out. Okay, I'll blast it out. Sit down. I would like to thank y'all for tuning in to this Dominic Cruz Showcase. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Huge it's been Heem the Dream. I'm out. Till next time. Peace.